Hey guys, so for our back training, we're gonna start off on a hamstring and throw. Um, as we've gone through before, isolating that lat and really stabilizing that scapula is gonna be a massive change in the way you think about all upper body training, because if we can really pin that scapula back and down and really stabilize that, everything in your upper body will, will continue to grow and actually we can balance our body a lot further because of that, that ability to control what's going on. So with a isolated row like this, we can really focus on wrapping that round and holding that position in the back. Um, if I get Harry to grab the handle, I'll, see why we, I'll show you why we're standing so far back. Um, because where that plate is perpendicular to the machine is where it's obviously going to be ha hardest. And as I get Harry to row back, that way it's actually going to taper off. So if I had Harry standing right up on that uh, bench, so walk right up to it, where most people are going to do this row, you're going to have that weight actually lighter where you're starting. And as you row back, you make it really, really hard there. So as we went through in the resistance band series, is it's going to make it a lot uh, harder where you're already weak and then there's no real weight where you're strong. So just to match that strength curve a little bit and really make sure your lat's doing the work, we're gonna get him to stand back here again. Now, as long as you're stabilizing, we're shoving a hand into this bench, make sure nothing from our torso is rotating and those hips are locked in place. So all you're gonna focus on doing is trying to engage that lat first, and then we're trying to pull this back and down as we pull through. So we're trying to actually wrap that elbow towards your lower spine. There's in no part of that that we think about just trying to pull that arm back. So we stretch way out, we're we'll that, that lengthen, we're gonna engage that lat by pulling that back first. And then once that really pinned in, we're gonna start bringing that arm through. So we're really thinking about wrapping that back. Okay, so show us a, a rep with your arm first. So you're just pulling that bar. If you're really bending. So go through how you wouldn't do it. So I just want you to pull that arm. You're gonna see people bending their elbow and keep pulling back. They're gonna keep pulling this way and you see how things actually rotate at the back. And that's gonna be one of the main things I wanna watch you move. If you really focus on pulling that shoulder blade down and wrapping towards your spine, that's as far as that lat can go, all right? If you keep pulling back, keep going back as far as you can, you're gonna see that either, well, in this machine it goes down, but this starts taking over, it's all your traps and your rear delts. So we're just trying to focus on what muscle you're actually trying to work.